Hey, in the previous video we talked about measures of dispersion. In this video we are going to learn to calculate it. Let's start with sum of squares. We are going to use a very simple data set today consisting of 2, 4 and 6. Mean of this data set is 4. When it comes to dispersion, we want to know how close or far the data lies from the mean. So to do that, we will subtract mean from every data point and end up with this number, minus 2, 0 and 2. In a perfect world, we could add it all up and be done, but because the mean is always the middle point in a data set, sum of all the difference is always going to be 0. So to prevent the plus and the minus from cancelling each other, what we do is we take square of each difference and add it all up. So it would become minus 2 squared plus 0 squared plus 2 squared, which is 8. Here's the formula for sum of squares. Variance. Well, variance is simply put sum of squares divided by number of data points minus 1. Here's the formula for the variance. Have a proper look. As you can see, the only difference between the sum of square and variance is it's getting divided by n minus 1. So back to our example, our sum of square is 8, our number of data points is 3, so 8 divided by 2 and that's 4, so our variance is 4. Finally we have standard deviation, have a look at the formula for standard deviation. As you can see the upper part of the formula is sum of squares. When the lower part gets added it becomes variance. And finally, when you add the square root to it, it becomes standard deviation. I have added another example data set. You can pause the video and calculate the sum of squares, variance and the standard deviation or just watch it being done. 